The Verify team exists to fact check the suspicious things spreading online and answer your questions. A lot of people on social media are talking about the long-term effects of COVID-19. Like this tweet from a woman who says that she's a trauma surgeon and ICU doctor. It says in part, quote, I don't know who needs to hear this, but post-COVID lungs look worse than any type of terrible smoker's lungs we've ever seen. So let's verify. Do people who recover from COVID-19 have worse lung damage than longtime smokers? Our sources are two pulmonologists or lung doctors. There's Dr. Panagis Galiatsatos at the Johns Hopkins School of Medicine. He's also the director of their tobacco treatment clinic. And Michael Maffei at the University of California, San Francisco. They both agree that the tweet is pretty darn accurate, although it's a little too broad. Meaning not all recovering COVID-19 patients have worse lungs than all smokers. Mild COVID would be like, I smoked for one decade. You know, smoking probably is going to triumph that. Severe COVID versus decades of smoking, I, I, I would give it all to severe COVID because that's, those are, it's just a much disastrous lung that we don't have a lot of interventions to help. And it, like I said, it's an incredibly friable lung. But Dr. Mathay says there is a silver lining. Many, if not most of the COVID-19 patients with severe lung injury will have a good prognosis for recovering most of their lung function. And that, that's exactly the difference with smoking-induced lung injury. The potential for recovery is minimal. It's also worth noting that a couple weeks after the tweet went viral, the poster then tweeted this. A reminder, this is my personal experience, not a trial or nationwide data. So we can verify that according to our experts, people recovering from severe COVID-19 have worse lung damage than habitual smokers. With your Verify, this is Evan Kozlov.